In this two-part investigation, we'll be going to the last known location of Elizabeth Short, the Black Dahlia, and we'll also be going to the location where they found her body. It looks like murder. Holy crap. Let's go. What? Elizabeth, if you're... <gasps> The Black Dahlia is one of the most notorious cold cases of all time. Why was a 22-year-old girl cut in half and drained of all her blood? I have questions, and tonight we're gonna find out answers from what really happened to Elizabeth Short, the Black Dahlia. Hi, I'm Nikki. And I'm Tori. These are the Got Ghost Girls, and tonight <laughs> we are going to solve the mystery of the Black Dahlia, hopefully. Oh no, we will. Yeah, we, will. we got this. We are going to this hotel on the anniversary of the day that we believe Elizabeth Short was killed. Paranormal activity should be crazy tonight. On January 9th, Elizabeth was dropped off at the Biltmore Hotel in downtown Los Angeles by a man named Red Manley. She told him that she had plans to meet up with her sister. Elizabeth was last seen by hotel staff in the lobby that day. On January 15th, her body was found in an empty lot, severed in half, drained of all of its blood. Her mouth had been cut from corner to corner, leaving her with a joker smile. Elizabeth Short was last seen in the hotel lobby by the telephones, making a phone call to somebody. We don't know who. I think she was calling maybe the person who did this to her. She said that she was gonna meet up with her sister. Which doesn't make sense. Which doesn't make sense because her sister's from Boston, but her sister never actually came here. So who was she meeting up with? You heard about the guy Red, right? I think she was ditching him, so she's probably meeting up with another guy. See, that's what I thought too, because I think she was talking to multiple men at one time. She yeah. was 22, in LA, has no money, has nowhere to live. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna find a sugar daddy. You think she was calling her sugar daddy? <laughs> Maybe. I mean, that's what I do. <laughs> I don't know if the exact telephone is still here. I saw somewhere in the lobby that there was like a place that said like telephone booth. So maybe it was there. Should we ask like some of the people at the front desk? I mean, they have to know, they work here. That says telephones and ATMs. Maybe that's where the old telephones were at? Yeah, they definitely have to be this spot. I'm gonna assume the telephones were like probably right here, which is now Boba. Phones were right here? Like telephone booth? Uh, we had them in the hallway by the restroom. Thank you. Thank you. Can I real quick? There's a picture of her. Oh my god. It's said the staff recalled seeing her use the lobby telephone. I wonder if it was like she was like asked the people in the lobby, hey, can right. I use the phone? <gasps> oh. Yeah. Yeah, because it doesn't say the telephone booth. Yeah, it's literally That's so interesting. the lobby telephone. Nobody knows what happened after she left this place. It's eerie thinking this was the last place she was seen alive. If you are here and you'd like to come with us, we are staying here, and we want to invite you to come and tell your story. <gasps> oh, that's spooky. That looks like murder. Holy crap. Let's go. No, are you kidding? That's got to be illegal. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Cameron, just keep the door open. We're going to go back there, okay? Yeah. Where was she? Why would she be held here? How do we know? How? Why not? It would be yeah. way easier to hide her in a room. Yeah, what is that? I know back in those times, things were heavily mob related. What if this hotel was ran by the mob? No, they said that Al Capone used to stay, stay in the suite. Yeah. The mob himself. <laughs> the he way is way. the mob. <laughs> and when we walked down here, all I could think was there's probably some underground that we don't know about. This place is really old. Should we go down there? Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Are we? 
we and why does this exist? Are we even in the same hotel? We've been like underground. Remember when we went to the Glen Tavern Inn? Like you literally predicted where we were. That's your talent. Trust your intuition. Something's up there. I don't know why. I don't know if it'll work on the glass. Let's see. Oh, there we go. No, that was weird. Nice. I am going to take over the Estes method. The girls have the questions. Hopefully, we get something. Accidentally. Call. You accidentally called someone? Who did you call? Spiral. I was thinking to ask- For the better. Like spiral staircase, but I don't know why that came to mind. I thought the same thing when she said spiral. Yeah. Is Elizabeth Short here? So terrified. Were you held hostage here? Two. Was there someone else with you? Another girl? A girl? When you went missing in 1947. Something has been trying to block. Well, oh, I don't know if spirits have the perception to like know what you're about to say. If Elizabeth was here with another girl that night, could she turn, turn off, off the flashlight? flashlight? Elizabeth, if you're... <gasps> oh my god. Okay. Elizabeth, it's okay if you don't know how to use this Estes method. If you prefer to just use the flashlight to communicate with us, that is perfectly okay. Okay. That was an It was awful. dramatic. That was dramatic. But you can also talk to Mackenzie. Did George have anything to do with your murder? George Harold was a prime suspect in the Dahlia case. He was a doctor and he also knew Elizabeth. His house was wiretapped and on the record he said, suppose I did kill the Dahlia. They can't prove it now. They can't talk to my secretary anymore because she's dead. It was stated that the manner Elizabeth had been cut in half by could only be done by a surgeon or someone who was in the medical field, which is why I believe that George Harold had something to do with her murder. Did George have anything to do with your murder? Go on. Then. I'll tell you. Okay. Then okay. Tell us. We want to know your story, so whatever you can tell us is helpful for us. Is there something stopping you from communicating with us? Captain. You could use him. Is there someone else that you are speaking through? Easily. Do you want to tell the captain what you want to say to us? Communication. Is the captain able to speak through the Estes method? It could be. So are you telling the captain to tell her? I have. Okay, are you telling us your story now? Each week. Did you come here weekly to see someone? A time. One time. One time. Were you meeting with the captain? If we say something correct, turn off the flashlight. I know you fell on some hard times while you were out here. Was there a captain who was- I giving you money? Private. You can trust us. You can tell us anything, we're not gonna judge you. For a date. For a date, okay. So, was he the person you were calling or was he the person you were meeting with? Inside. Inside, he was inside, okay. Could be a captain in the Navy because this was 1947. Yeah. This is right after World War II. Yeah. Somebody before. Okay. okay. So somebody you had met before. What if I had? I heard that. That was. Hello, Elizabeth. If you're still here, could you please give us a sign? Hi. Okay. Okay. Did you come to the Baltimore for a date? Did you come to this hotel for a date? Forget about it. Are you embarrassed? Go find me. Where do you want us to go? The to 15th. Is there a 15th? No. No. The 15th oh, the was 15th. the day she, was the day she, she died. was found. Dude, yeah. 
The day she was found was the You'll find me the 15th. We Okay, they, they found you. They found you. They found I have chills. Moved. Went on its own. Did you? I guess. Can you tell us what day you actually died? We, you were found on the fifteenth. Your last known whereabouts were the ninth. What day did you die? He January. January. He wants to say how old he. The captain. Let's leave out. I said they could turn off if we said something, right? Okay, okay. The doctor's here. Oh, shit. Oh, no. 32. Okay, so the captain wanted to say how old he was. 32. The doctor. If you know something about the body, can you tell us why there were cuts all over her body? Her chest, mainly? Why would someone do Lay back. Lay back? Are we talking to the doctor? The man. The man? That time. Is that what you preferred to be called instead of the doctor? Do you prefer to be called the man? Redemption and transformation. Yeah, I just heard a creepy yeah, voice. that was creepy. That was very clear. We could hear that with our ears. If you want redemption, there was a tap. Okay. That was not the mini fridge. Okay. If you, Bye. If you want redemption, who is this? What did you do to Elizabeth Short? Are you the doctor? I didn't know. You know about what happened? He asked me if I worked. I think we're talking to Elizabeth. Elizabeth, again. if this is you, was he asking you if you were possibly a sex worker? Yes. This is the. This is the Captain? second time. Captain. <gasps> Help me. Thank you for turning off the flashlight. Can you? Thank you. Do you know if there's any evidence still around that can help solve your murder? Basement. Did someone pay to do this to you? Mob. What if this hotel was ran by the mob? Did your torture happen in- Cross your places? legs. I know that a lot of people that had tattoos back in your day were ladies of the night. Were you- Paid a thousand. Were you a lady of the night? Of that cash. This girl's a gift. Ooh. Steak knife! Did they use a steak knife to cut you, Elizabeth? You're what telling me that's the mini fridge? that? Like, what? Hi. Scared? No. no. You're, You're not scaring us with your weird little tapping. mini fridge taps. <laughs> Go. Why are you trying to get rid of us? Are we getting too close to something? To finding something out that you don't want us to know? We're talking to the person that had something to do with Elizabeth's murder. Get it off your chest. Get redemption. Tell us what happened. Tell us who you are. Officials looked. Yes, officials looked and they found nothing. So who did this? The car. Okay. Yes. Um, Never found. Right. There was a car that witnesses said they thought they saw. Was that car never discovered? Next to God. Next to God, like that's the truth. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Where's the car now? Partners. There's an arrangement here. What's the arrangement? Yeah, I don't think they're gonna tell us. Can't do this. Okay. Okay. 
after reviewing this footage, I was completely shocked of the evidence that we got, which is why I knew tonight I need to go back to the location her body was found. Here's what I believe. Call me a conspiracy theorist, but I believe at the time the Biltmore Hotel was probably ran by the mob or mob affiliated. To someone who's unpredictable and in the mob back at the time, they did crazy things. I believe Elizabeth had an arrangement to be someone's main girl and this person would pay her the highest rate. Maybe she wasn't a sex worker, but she had an arrangement with someone where if she slept with them, they gave her money. Elizabeth was dating multiple other men. Maybe this person found out about it and she broke their arrangement. They did not like that. So that night she goes to the Biltmore Hotel, everything is normal, but they actually take her down the spiral staircase, lock her in the basement, and I think she was killed out of jealousy, rage, and anger. Whoever did this did it to get revenge. After looking through this footage, that is what I gather. This could be completely wrong, but that is what I think. So let's go to the location where Elizabeth Short's body was found. I want to be as respectful as possible. This is now residential housing. This is the real Black Dahlia body site. This is us, this little red thing. It's on South Norton Avenue. At the time, this was a giant dirt lot. The location that her body was found is someone's front yard. This is the location where her body was discovered at. Fire hydrant right here. If you look at it from right here, I'm gonna put in a picture and you can see in that picture, fire hydrant is in the very bottom part of the picture. There's a bunch of police officers down there in a circle and that's where her body was at. I'm trying to keep myself composed right now, but I'm like really scared. It just feels so like, look at, did you hear my voice? It's like cutting out. I'm yeah. like choked up. This is the location right here. Oh, look. There's like two dandelions right there. Imagine that's where like the top of her was. That's where the bottom of was. Well, yeah. The top of her was probably more on that side. Yeah. I can't believe this is it. Did they know where they were gonna drop her off at? Or did they just, they were like, this is a dirt law, I'm gonna leave her here. I don't know. This is someone's house, so I don't wanna stand out here too long, but now I have some questions and I wanna get to the bottom of this. We are parked right next to it. Like, that's where it's at. That's about as close as we can get. This is the flashlight that I use. It is a mini maglet flashlight, if anyone was wondering. This is what we use for paranormal investigations. Elizabeth, if you are here right now, please come through as clear as you can, like last time. So this is what I, you see that? It said, I'm ready. Thank you for coming through. Thank you. Elizabeth, we want to know who the captain is. The vehicle. Did you hear that? Yeah, I heard that. We know that the car has evidence in it. You told us last time. Do you know where the car is? I don't. I don't. I heard I don't. That's what I heard too. Do you know who the captain is? Yeah. 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 Elizabeth, we need to know what the captain's involvement was in your murder. There's half of people looking for. Was the captain a good man? Was the captain a bad man? There's a warning. Elizabeth, can you tell us if you were being held captive in the Biltmore Hotel? Were you being held captive with another person? Did you go to the Biltmore Hotel to meet a man to sleep with him for money? Was that yeah? I heard yeah. Oh my god, is that the woman who lives here? 
That's the woman who lives here. My neck hurts. What do you mean? That light just turned off over there. Is there something there? No. So fucking weird. I feel like something scratched me. False alarm. No demons here today. Thank God. <sighs> right? <laughs> Do you know where you were being held captive at, Elizabeth? Did it say downtown? Do you know why someone cut your face? I heard, yeah, why? Why did they cut your face? Do you know? I have every name of the main suspects that the police believe could have taken part in Elizabeth's murder. I'm gonna ask her one by one. Elizabeth, did Red Manley have anything to do with your murder? Did George Hodel take place in your death? Did Mark Hansen take place in your death? Did Leslie Dillon take place in your death? Did Bugsley Siegel take place in your death? Did Bugsley Siegel have anything to do with your death? Right there. Did Ar- No, the crime. Did Arnold Smith have anything to do with your death? The call. Did you call Arnold Smith that night that you were taken? Elizabeth, were you affiliated with anyone who was in the mob at any point? I don't think she's here anymore. Mm -hmm. I don't think this police captain, I don't think they were a good person. And if they had anything to do with her murder, it was probably they were paid off to cover up some stuff. Rest in peace, Elizabeth Short. All right, you can turn it off. As you say that, the light literally died. What the? F really? Yeah. Because you can hear if it turns on and off, there's a click. Like, look, I'll turn it off now. That is so weird. If you saw anything in this video that you think I missed or you have any idea of what happened to Elizabeth Short, please let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoy paranormal investigations like this, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, click the bell button, turn on your post notifications so you can be here first. If you want to, you can follow me on any of my social media at Mackenzie Marie and I will see you here in my next video. Toodles.